Gaten in quarter. Here's Cocker to Collins. Couldn't take it on the second grab. Harding kicks it off the ground. Comes back in the arms of Wild. Oh, yeah. Rockets the ball wide. Cocker to Collins. Some fancy footwork. Runs into the open goal and bangs it through. <laughs> Wanganeen appears to be okay. The lead is on. Tredray the target. A beautiful kick. Lovely lead, lovely pass. Was one of their two goal kickers in the first term. The distance is 55. It's a great kick by Warren Tredray. He's got his second. Deep in their attacking zone. The fourth. Big pack of players on. Oh, Josh Franco has given Port the lead for the first time in this game. Chalmers unloads a big bomb out in front here comes Wanganeen the skipper who we saw at quarter time had a bit of a wrist injury but seems to have recovered from just inside 50 the roar will tell the story he's got it comes up towards center wing Callahan has it spoiled by Francis he appears to have plenty of time Fabian got a couple of options here Stuart Dew now is a left footer, so can he get onto it? He oh. can get onto it with an absolute gem! What a goal, Stewie! It's been handy again today. That was a clever handball. Back to Stevens. Started on the interchange bench and then chips across to Josh Franco. Kicked two goals in the second term. Time for think music. Weighs up the options. Go back towards centre-half forward. Figgett tries a one-hander. Cocker two. Collins pinched it. 55 metres out. Goes short to Gavin Wanganeen. The skipper's going to run into the open goal. And nails it. Called it. Wild pushes back towards the centre. Now they can start some run here. Burgoyne on the defensive side of the middle. Picks out a teammate. Does it pretty well in the form of Dickey. He goes up towards the 50 metre line just inside. He's there, Brendan Lane. Man played state of origin football last year. He's kicked pretty truly. They've stretched their lead to 28 points. He'll set it up again. Just chips it. Bandy. Spent most, most of the game on the interchange bench. Again, a loose player. Keeping's off. Oh, magnificent. Read it well. Chipped in in front of Heath Black. <laughs> Kicking with the breeze. Frank goes away. A couple of bounces out of the middle. He's almost down to right half forward. Pulls it inboard now. In towards centre half forward. And a big mark taken by Treadray. This to stretch the lead to 22 points. Kicking from 40 metres. It's home. You're right, Daggy. It is home. 36 point lead to Port Power. They trailed by 16 points at quarter time. So a big turnaround in the game. Man. Juggled it, couldn't take it. Burgoyne, exciting young player. Over 20 possessions today. This will bring the hats down. Oh, he has trouble. And the Port supporters stand. Treadray and Laid kicked three each. Lyle catching the umpire's eye with three votes. Two from two. Yeah, look, we knew that uh, Fremantle are a side that just run the game out, and as you saw, you know, seven goals down, they still believe in themselves and keep going, so uh, we're just wrapped to uh, get our second win. And the Port Supporters standing tall, to believe... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably more Port Adelaide supporters here than Brisbane Lions supporters. They're everywhere. Ruck interference, no whistle, and a shot by Primus is a goal!